Hey, this is Matt from Chicago. You're watching Trucker Josh and Diesel and Chevy on TJV. Keep up the good work. Guess what, everybody? I'm at home all by myself today. Britt's at work. She left me at home all alone with the dog. So we got our foster boy, Big Frank. His name's Frankie also. We have another dog named Frankie, so we just call him Big Frank. Because he's bigger than the other one, believe it or not. <laughs> Fits right into our home. Perfect. We got the almighty, the one and only, Lord Weasel. Hey guys, how you going? Doing myself here, I miss mom. Oh, come on. Come on, you got goobers on your... You been fighting with your brother again? You been fighting with your brother? We'll be fine, we'll be fine. Where's the rest of the crew? Where's everybody? Doesn't anybody want to play with me? Hey, where is everybody? Where is everybody? <gasps> I found a Chevy. What are you doing in your cage, buddy? This is my home. That's my safe space. I miss mom. Oh, come on, guys. It's not so bad being at home alone with me, is it? We're gonna have fun. We're gonna have fun. Have you seen your little brother, Frankie? Where's we? Oh, there's a wiener. There's the wiener. Hey, buddy, let me turn some lights on in here so people can see you. Oh, there he is. Is mommy home yet? Come on, guys, it's not that bad being here with me, is it? I'm fun. I'm fun, right? Why are you putting in your cage? You guys want some carrots? Does anybody want some carrots? I give good treats. Wanna know why? Because I'm the fun one. Come on, come on. Come on, guys. Hey, Big Frank, you want some carrots? Want some carrots? Okay, carrots. Carrots is their uh, treat of choice. They all love carrots. Carrots, carrots, carrots. All righty, okay. Let's see. Let's put this somewhere where people can see. See how much you like the carrots. I will put you right there. All right, guys, who wants some carrots? Who sits first? Frankie, you're already sitting. Bit of a big piece, buddy. Can you handle that? Chew it, don't swallow it. Okay, good. Some for Chevy. Diesel, come here. Some for Diesel. Frankie, hey. Hey, buddy. You want some of this? Oh, yeah. Remember who the best one is. Remember who you love the most. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. Home Alone with Dad. Woo! Whoever gets that one gets it. Frankie, you get it. There you go, Chef. Oh, did it roll under the fridge? Did you get it? Did you get it? Oh, no! I got it. I got it. All right. All right. Wearing my PJ pants, because I'm all comfy. So yeah, Britt's at work today. She works uh, days all this week, and I'm at home all this week, because my truck is going into the shop. Uh, gotta bring it there tonight yet. It's gotta get, uh, uh, what's called a crankcase breather replaced, an oil separator. It's gotta get a full service. It's gotta get a tire replaced. It's got a little bit of work, so it's probably gonna take them, well, maybe the rest of this week. This next coming weekend is our Thanksgiving weekend, so I'm gonna be spending it with family. We're also installing this new door over here. We just picked it up, me and Britt, yesterday, or the day before, I think. So this is gonna be a sliding door. Maybe we'll like prop it up against the wall here to show you. Uh, this wardrobe is just where we store blankets and stuff. That's gonna be moving elsewhere. We don't know yet, but uh, that door is going to be going right in there. We're installing it on Saturday. And then uh, Sunday, I guess we're just hanging out here. I think I think Britt's dad and stepmom are coming down. 
And then on Monday, which is actually Thanksgiving Day, or for the long weekend, we're going to my parents' house. Gonna have Thanksgiving dinner, all the fixings and everything. It's exactly the same as American Thanksgiving. It's just, uh, like I said before, we do it a month earlier, and Canada doesn't make as big a deal of it as America does. I know Thanksgiving in America is this huge deal. Up here in Canada, it's the exact same thing, just on a smaller scale. It's just, just we're Canada, we're just, just a little bit, little bit toned down, except for Christmas. Christmas is the big one out here. Everybody goes all out for Christmas. So it's a beautiful day outside. I'm just editing some videos right now at my workstation, and then we're going to uh, go enjoy the outdoors. Maybe go on another little hike through our bush or something. It'll be fun, right? Right? It'll be fun because we're gonna have fun, right? Right? Because I'm the fun one, right? Why do you all look so bored? Diesel's laying down over there. Are you still eating your carrot? Where did little Frankie go? There he is. Okay, guys. We're gonna have a good day. Right, Wiener? Right? Well, if you say so, I, I guess so. What are you willing to do for it? What are you willing to do for it? One, okay. One, two, three! Oh, you missed it! Shoot! How about you, Diesel? How about you, Diesel? This one's for you. Are you willing to dance for it? Dance. Dance. Go in a circle. Oh, good boy. How about this way? Go in that way. Oh, good boy. Good boy. All right, I'm not too sure what your tricks are, Big Frank. Can you lay down? Can you lay down? <laughs> Everybody else lays down. <laughs> Can you lay down? Lay down. Oh, good boy. Good boy. Shake a paw. <laughs> Not you, Chevy. Diesel, shake a paw. <laughs> Diesel, shake a paw. Good boy, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Can I have the other one? Nice to meet you, thank you. Good boy. Okay, Chevy, you know this one. You know this one well. Shake a paw. Oh, good boy, shake the other one. Good boy, nice to meet you. Shake it again. Shake it again. How come I had to do it twice? Because you're special. What other tricks do you know, Frankie? You lay down. Can you sit up? Can you shake a paw? Can you shake a paw? There's a treat. Can you shake a paw? Shake, 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 shake a paw? Oh, good boy. Good boy. Okay, Big Frank, here's your chance to impress everybody. You shake a paw. You shake a paw. Sh shake a paw. Oh, good boy. You shake this one too? You shake, shake this one too? Oh, good boy. So yeah, we're kind of bored sitting at home, but we'll find something to do. I want to say it's almost kind of nice. I, I like have the whole house to myself. I don't even know what to do with myself. So many opportunities. I got a lot to get done. No time to have fun. We have to uh, get this air conditioner out of our window there in our messy room. That's actually not too bad. Yes, we have separate blankets because Brett steals all the blankets. So, me and my... Mastermind, 
devised the plan. We shall each have our own blanket. And then she can't steal my blanket. And if she does, that's just greedy. That's just greedy. So far it's been working good. So the weather has clouded over a little bit. The forecast is calling for snow in the next couple of days. So hopefully we won't have to install this thing in winter weather. It's not supposed to be winter weather, but you know, it's, it's the changing of the seasons. So it snows and then it melts and then it snows and then it melts, but we haven't had our first official snowfall of the season yet, but it's coming. We're supposed to get a pretty good dumping this, uh, this weekend. Hmm. It's gotta happen. We gotta go through the cycle so that we can get to next summer, right? This is the season of change. Man. Beautiful out there though, beautiful. Even though it's cold and miserable, still beautiful. So yeah, not much to show you today. I'm just sort of hanging out around here. Tomorrow we're gonna go spend a little bit more time outside uh, if it's not too rainy, not too wet. I wanna blaze a couple of new trails through our bush. Cause we, ha we have our trails through there right now, right? But Britt and I, we really like to walk. We haven't done enough of that this summer, but it is something we like to do. And I want to extend our network of trails through our property and through our bush here just so that we have, uh, you know, a nice little nature hike we can do whenever we want to right here on our own property. We can take the dogs with us. Uh, so I'm going to start clearing the trail. We'll see how far we get. We'll start on that tomorrow, though. I also have to, uh, I'll have to go into town this week because uh, I think I'm going to do that on Thursday, though. And it's uh, Tuesday today when I'm filming this. So... Uh, this door we're going to install on Saturday. So on Thursday, I think I'm going to go into town, go to E.G. Penner Building Supplies, and I got to get the brace, or pardon me, not the brace, the frame, because we've got to build the frame, right? So we're going to tear this wall out just big enough for the door, and then we've got to have a 12, 2 by 12 header on the top, and then we've got to get 2 by 4s for the side, like two on each side to hold up the, the header, and then two on each side of that, or one on each side of that for the frame up to the roof. So it'll be a little bit of work, but uh, I got my dad coming down, my father-in-law's coming down, uh, my cousin Chris is coming down to help a little bit, and all of them have experience in framing. I don't have any experience in framing. I'm pretty sure I could get it done, but it'll probably take me a lot longer than it should, and I don't want to make any mistakes. So they're going to come down, give me a hand, and we should be able to get it done. I think we'll be able to get it done, well, definitely before supper. I know we should probably be able to get most of it done, like, in the morning. Just a couple of hours. Like, all we got to do is cut a hole through here, throw the door in, put the flashing on, seal it up, bada bing, bada boom. We have a new back door. And then, like I was telling you, our next big project is this massive deck that's going to be in the back here. From approximately that tree over there, it'll go about up to that tree, starting there, all the way across, to meet up with the gazebo over there. This will all be platform little deck. Can't wait, because then we'll be able to sit back here and have our have our coffee back here. So I, I sort of like, well, in the morning, me and Brett always like to, at least in summer mornings, we like to sit out on the deck as much as possible, have our morning coffee out there. And this is a nice view of nature. You know, you got a lot more trees here and stuff. And our front yard, where we've been sitting currently in the mornings, it's nice. It is. It's a lot more open, though, right? It's the front yard. We got to, I was hoping to be able to mow that lawn before... The snow came, but I don't think that's going to happen. I'll just have to let it get covered by snow and we'll mow it in spring. But yeah, it's it's just much more open because it's, it's the front yard, right? And I'd much rather, like, this is a nice view and everything. The back won't have this veranda roof over it. It'll just be open. So on the rainy days, we'll have to sit in the front. But on the nice, sunny, warm days, we'll be able to sit back here. And just enjoy it. But yeah, tomorrow we're going to go out into the bush and work a little bit out there. So uh, yeah, a little bit of home time videos coming up yet. I know it's not the same as trucking. I know it may not be the as exciting as the trucking content. But you know, this is a vlog of my life. And part of being a truck driver, if it's what you're thinking of doing, part of that is your home time. My truck is in the shop. Uh, I've talked to the shop already and... Uh, uh, it's, it's most likely what we thought it was. The oil separator or the crank case breather. And it's a $1,900 part Canadian, so probably like $1,300 American. And plus they're gonna fix my mud flap for me, they're gonna weld that up for me. Uh, my license plate light was burnt out in the back, they're gonna fix that for me. 
Apparently two of my wheel seals are going as well. They're gonna fix that up for me. And I'm gonna get a new, uh, a new passenger steer tire. So a lot of money being spent right now. But we're gonna enjoy this time at home, right? We're not gonna think about that right now. We'll worry about that next month. Let's just enjoy our time at home now. So I hope you enjoyed these home time vlogs. Uh, I would love to give you trucking content, but you know, I need some home time too. And I love sharing what I do here at home with you. So this is a, a day at home alone with Trucker Josh. I know, riveting entertainment, right? But subscribe anyways, cause it gets better. It gets better, I promise. Okay? <laughs> I'll see you tomorrow. Tomorrow, we venture out into the wild. Hey, this is Matt from Chicago. You're watching Trucker Josh and Diesel and Chevy and TJV. Keep up the good work.